Oi, oi, lads. Now, uh, something. I'm not sure if this is a life gain deck or a counters deck or a mid range deck or an aggro deck, but it's now uh, something. Let's see what's up. There's actually quite a lot. There's not too much option when it comes to creatures, but there's a lot of options when it comes to the non creature spells in this deck, so we might be. Uh, <clears throat> might end up swapping them around a lot, but. Elver Andy. I wonder if just the other one drop guy is better. The new the new one drop that gains life better than the better than the escort. Just to Because right now only only four of our seven one drops actually proc our guy on turn two, right? And you, you kinda want all of them to proc the guy on turn two. Probably even over the protection, right? Or maybe you just play four veteran, four of the new guy, and like, say, two escorts. <clears throat> cool burn deck, bro. We have more one drops. Uh, there's there's a new one drop, yeah, but it's like it's a little bit harder to proc it, but it can. The new the new one is a one one where you you tap it to give a creature plus one power and gain one life. And uh, I mean, I think it would be fine in the deck, right? The only question is, do you play it instead of the Escort? Or alongside the Escort? The Reckless Impulse? The card is like, amazing man. <laughs> it's crazy. <clears throat> Just, we've got so much scry and draw in this deck. It's it's pretty gas. Scry and draw, but what can I say? <clears throat> Alaris Stance is a nice one to top deck, especially if, especially when we're like not getting it off the scouts, right? <clears throat> 
Just being able to like play scouts and keep that one in your hand. Alright, chat. Are are you are you in any way impressed by our game one performance here? I'm I'm kind of impressed. <coughs> Alright, I don't think opponent can burn us for 15 here, but maybe they can. Double play with fire. Bog jump. <clears throat> the, the veteran is just... I can't believe you also get, like, a two mana one one flyer as well. It's like nuts. All right. I mean, is their last card fade and hope? That is the that is the question, isn't it? Yes, it is. Uh, actually, maybe it's not. <clears throat> Could be thermal alchemist triggers, but you know. <clears throat> Regardless, I think we crack our guy here. On the voice. At least this way, if it is a fade and hope, uh, we still get to kill their alchemist, right? <clears throat> the, the, the scry off this Trellisara is like, honestly, it's incredible. Oops. Life gain versus... Oh, they're playing burn, huh? Hmm. Alright. Portable hole, please. Revelry, please. <clears throat> Where are they playing? Delver, Egg, Alchemist. Delver, Egg, Alchemist. Nah, uh, Paladin class is not that good to your man, I wouldn't say. game has crashed. Wow. <clears throat> that hasn't happened for a while. 
Excuse me? Has to be the worst matchup for the opponent. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't. I would rather be on our side of the battlefield in this matchup. <laughs> yeah, after this match, we'll add. We'll add that one mana guy, huh? I'm still not sure whether to keep the all in box though. The all in box is maybe just like a bad Valorous stance, you know? That's my that's my concern. There'll be a draft today. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to play one draft today, man. I think I'm going to play... I'm going to try and play one draft a day for the next, like, few weeks because... The draft, o the next, the next arena open is draft, right? And uh, we're obviously going to play that, and I would, I would like to play it as a prepared gamer rather than an unprepared gamer, if possible. <clears throat> just one, well, just one a day. Maybe, maybe like one a day in the middle of the stream. A little bit of standard or historic, then a draft, then a little bit of standard or historic. And that can be... That can be the stream. Close to casting the land, I did. I'm, I'm saving it, man. I'm saving it for my four four angels. Four four angels plus Toski. But this card is broken, man. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> we require more reckless impulse. <clears throat> Angel fire uh, ignition plus Toski. By the way. Is that a combo? Maybe. Okay. One of bolts our face. I mean, you have to respect it, right? <clears throat> One is left an amount of mana available that I don't trust, therefore I pass the turn. <clears throat> I'll be paying that Jawari next turn, Bish. <clears throat> Dude, what the fuck, man? They're just burning my face. This guy's crazy. Okay. Emirius Call plus Portable Hole. That's a Pog Champ. Not being able to get the cave down kind of sucks, but in exchange for that, we get to we get to draw a card. <coughs> Oh, 
Oh shit. Hey man, that's good here by the way. We can cast both sides in one turn as well. Go on, lad, tap your blue mana. I mean, you kind of want to buff the Tosca, but you also just want to gain a million life, don't you? We go back to 24, and we draw 3. I'd like to pay out the believers here. His hand would be a lot better if this was a Trellisara, huh? To be able to get the... You wouldn't mind having a, a bunch of lands if you were getting some scries off too. I think you still keep this though. <clears throat> I'm still considering like third reckless impulse. I think it could be. That card's been sick so far whenever we've found it. Blue white. Two mana three three that grows. Pog. Alright, hopefully we don't have to use our Veil this turn. <laughs> Faithful Mending? Alright chat, let's just hit him four more times with our voice of the blessed. Cropium? What do you mean cropium? Opponent's blowing it all on one dude. Oh man, I'm one man off, huh? <sighs> one man off, man. I guess we still go for it. <clears throat> I think this is fine. We've still got the man land back up too. And we get a scry here. Okay, 
I mean, you can scry a land to the top, and then you can uh, attack with a man land with Veil, but that just seems horrible. <clears throat> All right, we're through three Doom Scars already, by the way. <clears throat> You're running out of juice, my friend. <clears throat> You're running out of juice. Wait, they didn't even cast the mending? Okay, I do that again. Smile. Mm -mm. I draw two cards. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Yes, play the land first, because then you can uh, we can pay a Jawari disruption on this next gun veil if we need it. I thought they were going to bounce my veil there and I didn't have a green up <laughs> when I could have. That would have uh, infuriated me. I don't know if I have to use full control there. Probably not, right? But I'm willing to play it safe. <clears throat> But where are my valorous stances, man? For these frickin' liars. Oh. Hog. <laughs> it's pretty good. Why, auto tapper? Why, 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 man? Why are you wanting to- don't tap my fucking man land, because you're going to make me have to play my land first? <sighs> what is this shit? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Ronan, I present to you with some information. How would you like to use that information? What would you like to do with the information? I manually tap two lands. <clears throat> you chose to die? Okay. Let's go. Fog. <clears throat> Stance does counter stance. Mm -mm. Alright. Curse of Hospitality. I've got a question, guys. Like, is this card just trash? <laughs> it feels like it's only good if the trample is relevant. Like, it's, it's nice against the, like, the black control decks, you know, with all their with all their sh stupid shambling ghasts and stuff. It's kind of scuffed here though, right? We can bring in our Sentinel, our Paladin class, our Toski. Liberator? 
I mean, okay, I mean, Liberator has to be good, surely? Against blue light control? No, maybe not. Like we don't, we don't really have, we don't actually have enough space to play the Sentinel and the Liberators. But I guess you gotta just play the one that you know is definitely good, over the one that might be good, because they might not even be playing like Portable Hole and stuff, right? Like they prob, they probably are, but <clears throat> they have a high incentive to play. Instance and sorceries, and like a very low incentive to play a portable hole. Dude, what the hell do I cut, man? This is insane. You know what? Fuck the Paladin class. Alright, Paladin class is out. Curse is probably out. <clears throat> Should play the green counter enchantment? What's that? Green counter enchantment. Is that is that the thing that flips into a vigil instead? <clears throat> he kinda sucks, does he not? The veil and stance, like, <laughs> just so insanely good. <clears throat> it's kind of crazy. Give me my scries, bish. <clears throat> <laughs> our deck is also like really good against Fade and Hope just because we, we can regrow our guys so quickly it's kind of gas Give me my scries. I mean, I kind of want to keep that just as a way to uh, like refill my life gain, guys, if there's a Doomscar coming in or something. But 
I mean, I also want to find my scouts and my Toskies and my Imposes and my Angel Fires. I'm pogging. Chat, are you enjoying the deck? I'm absolutely loving playing it, so I'm hoping you're enjoying watching it. Yeah, sure, man. Bounce my guy. Cool. <clears throat> I'll just play it again, bruv. Give me those scries again, Bish. Any scouts? Mono red? I've tried mono red, man, yeah. <laughs> Dude, these Faith and Hopes are like just trash. It's so good though. <laughs> <clears throat> nice control card, mate. Nice boom scar, mate. <laughs> Test of talents? What? <laughs> this is game two. <clears throat> Test of talents? Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. We only run two copies of that, so it's alright. <clears throat> they actually have this available here, which we need to be careful of. These veterans are fucking sick, man. I can't believe that the disturb cost is only two. It's crazy. <clears throat> Feels a little bit bad to bottom that, but it's all right. I cannot believe how good these two cards are, guys. It almost turns like this matchup into a kind of a formality almost. <clears throat> Am I willing to attack for five and stand there man land? <clears throat> they would take me off being able to kill a liar, a liar, sorry. But they would, they would have liar, and they would need a blue land to have access to only fading hope. And I would have my veil, huh? Okay. 
Cemetery Protector. Okay, Pog. That's fine. The only way I'm forced to use my Veil is if they block my... Uh, okay. The only way I'm forced to use my Veil here is if they lose their guy, right? So... It's whatever. <clears throat> uh, please, wizards, bless me with uh, some things. May I be blessed with uh, some of our eight draw spells? Yeah, they did have the liar, huh? Okay, that's fine, I think. <clears throat> Very interesting chat. They have access to one fading hope. So they're gonna get a token though, right off of this protector. Hmm. It's a bit annoying, isn't it? Only if they cast a creature. Nah, there's a... It's an instant, right? They cast an instant, they get a token. I think I'll start with this. <clears throat> See what's up. Two scries, Pog. We really need some of our, like, high number of draw spells here. Not finding them, man. These phantoms are like really good against the fade and hopes, huh? Because they can't really fade and hope them, and if they if they fade and hope this phantom, it gives us back the veteran, which is just like even better than the creature that's already in play. <clears throat> which is kinda weird. <clears throat> So they, they might have to ju just cast the Doomscar. Do I not get it back? No, I do, I, I do get it back, right? It's if it would be put into a graveyard, do you exile it? Do I not? I'm pretty sure I get the Veteran back. I should play this sky and then don't know whether to play both though. I 
if they activate their manland, <clears throat> they're gonna have what? Untapped blue, untapped white. Ah, thinking, thinking, thinking. My problem here is that if they, if I commit this other voice of the blessed. They can just bounce their liar, make a token off the protector, chump, go to two. Doom scar, right? So I actually can't, I can't commit the other one, even though I'm going to get life gain triggers here once they use their fading hopes. I have to attack with only one in play. It's very annoying that I can't attack with my phantoms, man. Right, they top decked a horror, which is just incredibly unfortunate for us. <clears throat> One counter off being able to like successfully make that attack is horrific. <clears throat> <laughs> Matchup is I mean it's hard if we draw zero of our draw spells. If we can draw more than zero it looks uh looks like we've got a good shot. <clears throat> You're bouncing the phantom? You are a fool. Why would you bounce the phantom, man? <clears throat> what? Alright, opponent is mindlessly using our cards, which is good. <clears throat> nothing I do matters now. How does nothing I do matter now? They've got, like, no spells left, man. Opponent is favourite to win this game, but it's nowhere near over. Top deck in a second threat in a row is a little annoying. That's quite unlikely. Mm -hmm. uh, couldn't they have just eaten my snakeskin veil? Pretty sure they could, right? <clears throat> Alright, one sec guys, then we'll do game three.
Oh shit. <clears throat> Negate and test of talents, huh? Very interesting. I guess we cut this escort. In the main deck lately, what negating test of talents? Hard cards to main deck in the in the Thalia meta. I M O. Reanimator will be possible with Olivia in the format? Um, possible, yes, but it's just like. Reanimator is just kind of a scuffed strategy, isn't it? It's so easy to hate out because you're like. You're all in on this one threat. <clears throat> like reanimator is not is reanimator good in like any format at all it's a fun deck i mean it might be fun yeah but that's that wasn't the question top deck and modern I think you might be lying. Top deck and modern. <clears throat> it's not actually good in Legacy, is it? I'm sure I'm sure that some human beings play it in Legacy. But it's not actually a good, is it? That's two different things, you know? <clears throat> Three Fade and Hopes. Guys, fa like, Fade and Hope is... We, we don't care about Fade and Hope, man. I'd rather his hand was Fade and Hopes than... than other stuff. It's okay. Oh my god, uh, do I have to be scared of this fucking 3-4 guy? I guess so. These scries are so sick! Bounce, bounce, bouncy, bounce. Order in two turns. Yeah, I've got a, I've got a stance for him though, at least. Mm -hmm. 
I don't know why they gave us a, a trigger. I mean, I guess I could get the trigger regardless. The animator is about this important thing called mana cheating. Yeah, I mean, the animator, of course it can be good, but it is an incredibly easy strategy to interact with, right? Like, just graveyard and, uh, well, not, not even graveyard and removal spells, graveyard or removal spells, and you're, you're chilling, right? <clears throat> graveyard hate or removal spells, I mean. Or bounce, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, are, is, are any cards in my deck not, not lands? <laughs> it appears uh, maybe not. Why did they take it? Well, if they if they used their Fade and Hope last turn, I could have... Uh, <clears throat> I could have killed the Liar, right? <laughs> Land? Classic. Lantern seems decent. I don't know, man. Like, I, I, honestly, I don't think the bounce spells matter. Tosky! Now we're talking, baby. <laughs> it mattered last turn? Why does it matter, man? They're like... <clears throat> they're not nothing is happening in this game they're they're just casting the bounce spells and i'm recasting the guys like nobody's taking any damage like <clears throat> some of you guys just can't wrap your head around the fact that this the game state progressing nothing is not bad for us <clears throat> like this is fine They, they are using cards. We are using no cards. It's okay. I mean, I would rather the liar wasn't there. But 
It's not doing anything. Once they start rebuying mascot exhibitions, that's when the liar become is actually affecting the board. <clears throat> I think we just scry everything to the bottom that's not like our draw spells, I would imagine. Mm -hmm. It's not doing anything? Well, it's not. It's, they're, they're not progressing towards victory here, right? <clears throat> Like, I'm not I'm not saying this is perfect for us, but there's entirely worse things they could be doing than this. <clears throat> right, worse things for us, I mean. I killed a liar. Why? It's not again, I did it, I repeat it, it's not doing anything. We just have to dodge, like, n negate, seeing negate there is good. <clears throat> test of talents would have been bad, obviously. <clears throat> well, test of talents would have been bad for multiple reasons. One, because we're top, trying to top deck another Valorous stance, and secondly, because every negate that they use makes it more likely that the scouts will resolve, right? Because the scouts can get past the test of talents. Alright, what's our order of cards here? <clears throat> they have what? They have basically one card here? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. It's a long match, huh? Yeah, this is probably our best time. I mean, obviously the scouts can <clears throat> sometimes not resolve here, but this is our best chance at least. Okay, well, we've got to play both of these. <laughs> 
They've only got one field of ruin. <laughs> Come on, Toski. Take me home, baby. They're down to one, one divide by zero. Four, seven, nine, huh? Nine manas. <clears throat> Divide by zero can target this phantom, right? It's one it's one CMC. That's why being so good against the base, the bounce spells is nice, right? Because I, I don't actually even have to kill Liar. I, I mean, if opponent offers me up a good spot to kill her, obviously I will. But we can play this match without killing her. Fucking long game though, isn't it? <clears throat> long EF. I, I can't believe. I don't know. I don't really understand why they discarded that max mascot exhibition. I think they had time to cast uh, both. Snake's Gun Veil is sick, but it's, uh, we're obviously on a bit of a clock to actually use it. I really want to cast my scouts, man. <laughs> I 
I really want to cast my scouts, man. <clears throat> and I have lethal now. Sorry I can't, for my I can't slow game. That too well. It's really hard, and I have to think a lot. By the way, to the people in chat saying I'm sniping, that's totally rude. I expect an apology, or I'll report you. Four, seven, ten, eleven. <laughs> the Alert Kettle. Been fun. Ecuador. Ecuador.